Hey YouTube, did you miss me? <laughs> hey everybody, I have really been in like deep meditation, long story. The point is I have been like very connected to the most high, to spirit, to the great spirit. And I've just really been getting exposed out here. And when I say out here, I mean like in here you know, within. And I just want to encourage myself and everybody who is watching to jump in. A lot of times we have these things that we are afraid of doing and our ego can take over and just start honestly yapping its mouth so loudly that we aren't listening to the whisper of God. We aren't listening to the whisper of our higher self where it's guiding us you know and just to be straight up i have like i've been healing from a lot of like trauma due to like you know my spiritual evolution that i have publicly shared over the past four years and you know a lot of people were not kind to me and i felt like I needed to let all YouTubes go because I was trying to like avoid that cycle from happening, you know? But I've been learning that the only way to get over something is to actually go through it. Like there's no going over something, you have to go through it. And I allowed that fear to really like see, let me see things in black and white cognitive distortions, which means that I don't look at the gray area. Like when I felt spirit say like encourage me to let go or give me permission to let go of my youtube channels i let go of all of them but <laughs> when i went back and i meditate the next day i was like really hearing like uh i didn't say to let go of all of them i say you can let go of your youtube channels and remember i have three and i just really let go of this one because of my own fear i said it it's because of my own fear i've been afraid to jump in and and really stand in my truth that not just like oh like you know everything is love blah 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 like really balancing out truth and love i have a lot of things to say and i've been afraid of of losing people or being ridiculed again and that's not the way to go through it. That was me going over it. So please be patient with me. I I know that um, I said that I was gonna post a video every Tuesday, right? Around 7.07, of course, like sometimes my minutes are off maybe by a half hour, um, but that is life. You know, I'm not perfect. I'm not um, anyone who is like, you know, really better than anybody. I've, you know, I see myself as an equal of you. And I think sometimes I put this unrealistic pressure on myself to be more than I actually am, but I am that I am. Like I am already where I'm supposed to be. My skill level, the knowledge that I have to share is enough. Uh, you know, I, I, I sometimes feel like, oh no, I maybe I can, really continue my YouTube channel like 10 years from now when I am here and I'm there and I know this and I know that, but spirit is is calling us to be where we are right now with, with who we are right now. And everything that we are becoming, it, it's already here. Like we already are those things, but until we go through the thing that we are trying to get over, we're never going to fully become that higher self. We're never gonna fully become who we came here to be. And I'm not here in this lifetime taking any shortcuts. I've I've had a lot of past lives and there, you know, maybe I can talk about this another time, but in my in a lot of my past lives, I have been like in trouble uh, speaking my mind. And I know that's something that I have to heal in this life, that I am going to heal in this life. Come on, 
uh, like I'm not going to repeat that cycle of, of shying away now because of that past life trauma. Like I'm here. I'm here for you. I'm here with you. I, you know, I'm not saying I know everything. I know some things and I do uh, want to speak my mind and I am going to. When it comes to starting this YouTube channel up, like for real, for real, like getting back into that consistency, please be patient with me. I do have a lot going on and I am just really listening and, and not trying to be, uh, see things in a black or white cognitive distortion. Uh, I'm very, I'm a very all or nothing person. And I think it's due to like my, like being raised Christian of, you know, you had to be either hot or cold for Jesus. You can't be in between. And I kind of took that into like all areas of my life, even without being Christian anymore, really being all or nothing with something. And I am going to continue to meditate and figure out the next steps. But maybe I just got to jump in, you know. So I hope this message uh, cleared up some things and also encouraged you in some kind of way. And I appreciate you. Subscribe to join the tribe. We are back, baby. Woo! Okay, see you later. I love you. I really do. I'm here. You're here. We are here together. See ya.